What's up guys, it is Andrew here and welcome to Among the Sleep. You guys may be familiar with this game because I've done an entire playthrough of the main story on my channel. Uh, Krillbyte Studios, the developers of this game, have released a free DLC. It is a prologue and I actually loved Among the Sleep. I thought that uh, the art style was beautiful, I thought that the story was great, um, and there was a lot of speculation as to what the ending of the main story actually meant. Um, hopefully this will shine a little bit of light on it, um, but here is the prologue, clicked on lock, okay, and let's hop into the game. So for any of you who uh, may have not watched it and you kind of just want to know what happened, um, pretty much you're a baby and you're this baby, you're this guy. Uh, and in the, in, in the entire game, you're haunted by a bunch of monsters, which you find out at the very end of the game, those monsters were kind of just like a metaphor um, for your mother, because your mother was an alcoholic and she was abusive. Uh, and the teddy bear, who is like your companion in the game, he's your best friend, that is a metaphor for your father, who ends up rescuing you from your mother at the end of the game. What the hell? Can I go through here? Oh. Oh, it's like snowing in my room. What's this about? Huh. The one thing I really loved about this game was it's really cold. unique. So, so cold. Yes, it is. The thing I loved about this game was it's really unique uh, exploration, uh, like this, for example. Pull out the drawer, then climb it, then... Ha! It's locked! But since you're a baby, you gotta get really creative with the way that you... Let's probably close the window. Can you hop up here, pal? No, close it. There we go. Ah, everything melts when you do that. Please. More warm, more happy. Yes, more warm, more happy. So what do we got to do now at this point? Maybe come check out what's in our closet. We got a picture in here. I need to brush up on my artistic abilities. Although I am a baby and in real life I can't even draw like that. Okay, here we go. Monster don't like happy at all. Monster like sad. It's still locked though. I thought for sure. Wait, are you? Were you the one talking to me there? That just tripped me out. The others hiding. Oh, scared. Please help them. I will find them. We will find them. Don't worry, owl creature. Let's go find your monster friends. Sorry, creature friends. They're not monsters. Whoop, whoop, a monster. Crap. I don't know where to go. Oh, uh, is that mommy? Help, please. That was mommy. Hitting the booze again, huh, mom? Help. Okay, so there's obviously someone in this room. So I'm gonna stick with the theme here. Go ahead and say we probably have to close this window. Huh. How do we get to said window? That's weird. I'm like right under it. Okay, so we got to figure out how to get up here. Oh wait, there's a window here. So that might... Huh. Interesting. Maybe we close the fridge too. That's probably a little cold. <laughs> I don't know.
There's our little creature friend up there. We need to... Figure out a way to get rid of the snow. Maybe... Maybe I'm not supposed to save this creature yet. Maybe I gotta save another creature first or something. I don't know. Just going out on a limb here. Let's go. Let's go see if we can find another one of the creatures. Shut up! Stop crying! Wow. Sorry that I'm a baby mom. <laughs> Women. Okay, wait. Hold on. I want to read it. I can't read. I'm sub I'm guessing since I'm a baby, that's why I can't pick up the notes. Babies aren't usually great with reading. <laughs> Babies usually have the reading skill of a baby, which is not at all no reading skills. Hmm. So it looks like we got to climb up here. Or at least not have to, but there's the ability to. I don't know why I came up here. That was awfully unimportant, baby. Hey, is this one of our creature friends? No. It is a snail. It is a toy. This is not one of our friends. That was odd. Oh shit! Go, 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 baby, go! Go, baby, go! Under the chair or something. Nope, did I die? I didn't know where to go there. Yes, I'd like to continue, please. I got jibber jabbered. Okay. So we're back to this part again. We know we can't close that, but we do know there's a friend in here that we can save. We just need to be smarter about our hiding situation. Crawling, by the way, in this game is faster than running. Cold. Happy, please. More happy. Yes, I'm coming for you. No, I need to... I need to find the... Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You gotta find, like, the little jukebox. There's just literally toys everywhere. No kidding, Mommy hates you. Ah, oh, that was Bean. I'm sorry. You're a good baby. We need to find the thing. Last time there was like a jukebox we had to like... Not a jukebox. Uh, one of those little ballerina spinny musical devices. I don't even know what they're actually called, but... Maybe it's in here. What is that? A fish? There's like a fish in there. But not a, not a jukebox device. I don't, huh. These are a bunch of cars. So that's not cold. it. I know, you're cold, I'm sorry. Happy, please. More happy. More happy, yes. I agree, we, need, we all need to be more happy. <laughs> all of us. Is that it? Is that it there? Trying to just get a good look around the room. I don't think this is it. Nope. Alright, well, sorry lady. You're going to stay in there for a while too. Unless it's in one of these drawers. Oh, damn it. Nope. Well, I couldn't find it, so I apologize. Next room. <laughs> This game is really eerie without being, like, jump scary, and that's why I really like it. Yes, mama? <sighs> that 
That's the first little bit at all that we've ever seen of the dad. I hear strange noises. I don't like it. Maybe we gotta go upstairs. <laughs> it's kind of cute. Go, baby, go. Ah, it's locked. Damn it, monster. That's what I think of you, monster. Alright. So we need to uncover the mysteries that is... Ooh, there's a basement. No one's ever said that, though. Ooh, ooh, a dark basement. Ooh, how intriguing. It is incredibly dark. There we go. Thank you. Uh-oh, mother. Help me. Oh. There's a little furry friend down here. No. Light. It's okay, we got light, we got light, we got it. Whoa, loud noises. I got the light on, what are you talking about? Alright, time to figure this out. Oh, does the light like- HOLY SHIT! <laughs> I did not see that coming. <laughs> did that furnace just come alive and eat me? Is that what just happened? A furnace ate me? No. No. Light. What is this saying? I shouldn't turn on the light? Coming. Go out of the way, you two. There we go. Now we got a stool there. So we know we can move the stool. Kind of put that wherever we need to. I don't know where the thing is. Oh shit! Go baby! Hurry! Oh no! Go door! Oh shit. Door! Huh. Isn't that interesting? Maybe... No, no light means that I shouldn't turn on the light. No. No. Light. Or maybe no no light means I totally should turn on the light. Hurry. Holy shit. Light. Holy shit. Yeah, hurry light means turn on the light. Yep. That's what it means. Come on. <laughs> Baby. Baby, no. We were so close. Alright, so turn on the light. We need to do that. <laughs> Turning on the light is something we need to do. Okay, let's remember that. No! No! Light! Okay, so maybe the light expires. That's what the hurry is for. Oh, there's a light right there, too. So when the light clicks off, I just gotta click it back on. Come on. Uh-oh. There we go. Hey! Thank you. What's up, pal? 
No problem. Let's go find our other pals. Alright, so we got what, two? So we know that there's one in the kitchen somewhere. Uh-oh. Shit. Okay, this moves. Whew, I was like, ah, oh, I gotta go all the way back for that stool. Poop. But nope. We good. All right, that is enough of the basement. Upstairs we go, never to traverse down here again. Okay. Time to unlock the mysteries in the other rooms. Alright, books falling on the ground without a reason. This is another room. This might be... I don't know whose room that is. There's no crib, so it's obviously not mine. And I'm assuming Mommy and Daddy sleep in the same room, unless it's hinting at they don't. That could be what it is. Okay, this is Daddy's office, where he cheats on Mommy. Mommy doesn't like it, so she drinks. <laughs> Let's figure out... Let's figure out this kitchen mystery here. Someone might have already seen it already and was like, Andrew, wait, no, go back! So we gotta figure this out. Okay, so, we've established that it's cold. For some reason I can't reach this. I'm screwed, I have nowhere to go. That was an unfair death. Stupid. Stupid, stupid. <laughs> Alright. We need to now... Happy, please. More, happy. more happy indeed. So, we need to figure out how to help Mrs. More Happy over here. Perhaps we climb up on this. I'm hearing some weird shizzle. There's a light, but that did nothing. Oh. Okay. Thank you. No problem, little girl. So we now have three. I think there was five. But there might have been four. Okay, so it's more than just finding a jukebox. I thought it was a, the jukebox thing, but it's not. You just gotta figure out a way to give them. life to the area. So let's use our creative minds in the kitchen and figure out a way to give life to the kitchen. Let's see here. We got a couple jars. Those obviously aren't it. You're in a bunch of really weird music. Is it something in here, maybe? I don't know. I'm just making a big baby mess. We've already been up here, and it wasn't anything, was it? I mean, we closed the window, but we didn't really... We actually didn't really look around much, but... Oh, there's a... Yeah, there's a light here. Nope. It's not that. Can we drag the chair? On the snow? No. The chair can't go on the snow. This is a tough one. The chair can't go on the snow. All the drawers seem to be... Oh, there you are. What's up, pal? Oh, wait a second. I don't know why I didn't think of this. Sigh, Andrew. Ooh, a knife. 
That is not something a baby should be playing with, Mom. I know, so, I know, so cold. I know. We got it, I got you. We're good. Now. Happy, please. More happy. Yes, more happy. So, how do we get you more happy? You're a cute little one. Okay, how do we get you more happy? By making a big mess? Does that make you happy? No. Oh, there we go. I got it, I got it, I got it. over here oh shit oh shit oh shit I hear a monster let's turn this on yay more happy see Thank you. no problem is that it oh cool we can use them huh there's another one oh maybe we go upstairs Maybe that unlocked. Yes, it did. Okay. Unlock the mysteries of the... I don't even know their last name. Manor. Huh. Locked. Ooh, that was a creepy monster. Had a cloak. Cloaks are always creepy. My rule of thumb is never trust a man with a cloak. Holy crap. There's the last one. How do we get there? Don't worry, I'll figure it out. Huh. Pretty sure I can't go like through this, can I? Well, man, if you're so cold, you probably shouldn't sit on the open windowsill. Just wanna throw that out there. Just, just trying to help you out temporarily here. All right, baby, no worries. I'll figure it out. Okay, so we gotta... Oh, there we go. I think I got it. I think I saw what we need to do. Is bring this out. Come up here. There we go. A little exploring never hurt no one. There's a little... little 2 by 4 here. Oh! What was I saying about the windowsill, huh? What did I just tell you about that, huh? You never listen, Trinky. It's your new name, Trinky the Bear. Uh-oh. You have no idea what you're talking about. I can manage on my own. Oh, he was about to hit her. Maybe Daddy wasn't as nice as you think he is from the first game. You think that Daddy's the savior. Oh, she's packing her shit. She's packing her shit and hitting the road, Jack. I'm guessing this is gonna lead me outside. Why is she humming? She sounds happy. That would explain why this game takes place in a totally separate house. 
Like this this is a new house to me. There you are. Always acting so silly. Oh, I can't pick you up. Wait a second. That is not my toy. Where is my toy? That is a toy. Not my well, it's probably my toy as well. But what I'm trying to say here. Ooh, there's like weird foot these are like teddy bear footsteps, so it ran. Yeah, I hear you. I'm coming. I know. That's why you shouldn't have fallen out the window. There you are, pal. Hey, it's me. No! My toy! Wait! Bunny! No. That was actually sad. It got up and tried to, like. Aww. Mommy's not nice. Completed Among the Sleep. Achievement unlocked. So that seems to be the end of the prologue, and it is. Curl Bright Studios is. And a bunch of names. That is the end of the prologue. I thought it was really cool. It kind of actually sheds a little bit of light on who the father is, because like I said, in the main story, you, all you know is that the mother's an alcoholic and uh, she's not a very good mom. And at the end of the game, the dad comes and takes you away and saves you. And the dad is the same voice as the teddy bear. So you're like, okay, the dad and teddy bear are the same person. Therefore, dad is good. In this one, it seemed kind of like dad was neglecting the mom. He was always in his office. That's why the mom was kind of like leaning up against the door. And then you hear them arguing. And when you go through, you see the dad raising a hand. So he's probably abusive. Wow, it's a, it's a really good game. I, I really, really like this game. I hope there's like an Among the Sleep 2 or more DLC or something. Although some things are honestly better left untouched. And, uh... I don't know, this was really good. If you guys enjoyed it, please leave a like, comment in the comment section below, subscribe if you're new here. Bye bye, love your face, bye bye.